we met at a heart attack factory, SNL. Yeah. When you, uh, when you hosted in 2001. And you went back recently uh, to play Rex Tillerson. Uh, there you go. Sadly, he was not. He was not long for the administration. This no. will not be a gravy train for you. No. Yeah. It, it's no. It's, He's it's already over. done. You know, the, the rich, the fine paychecks, the fat paychecks you get off being an extra on SNL. When you played, uh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> when you, of course, during the Lewinsky scandal, you played Linda Tripp yeah. famously. How many times do you think you played her over the course of that? I whole thought time? one too many, but. Uh, <laughs> Uh, apparently they they liked it, so they kept uh, writing, they kept writing, writing, writing little capers for me, and I, I just thought it was because I looked cute in a dress. You did. <laughs> I think everybody did. You. <laughs> <laughs> is there is there anyone in the administration now that Tillerson's out? Is there anyone that you would like to play? Yeah, I, I want to be the thug that threatened Stormy Daniels in the parking lot. Oh line. yeah. <laughs> I want to be that guy. There's a lot of ways you can go with that. Yeah. You, know, you can get the like the Rudy Giuliani thing, which is like uh, second-rate Tom Hagen. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's the thing. I, because of what we're seeing as far as the uh, aptitude of everybody in this administration, he might not have been an effective thug. Like he might have been like maybe less thuggish than a normal guy. Yeah. It's like... He might have gone up to him and been like, "Excuse me, are you Stormy Daniels?" <laughs> but before you sign this. Could you do me a favor? Lay off Trump. <laughs> I love your work. Um, I the last uh, the last time you hosted that I was there, I wrote a sketch and uh, you were so wonderful. It did not go to air. No. It was a hard cut between dress and air. Yeah. It was a, a scene where you worked at a novelty uh, toy factory. Like, yeah. You were the boss, and uh, there you are right now. I. You know why the bit died. Why? That mustache. Yeah, you think? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you always a killer yeah. mustache. But, uh, and the thing was, there were breakaway chairs because it was, it was a novelty toy store, so all yeah. the chairs were breakaway. Yeah. And Bobby Moynihan was your employee, and you kept giving him bad news, and every time he sat down, the chair would break. <laughs> <laughs> no, try this one. This and, is, uh, no, do you remember, do you remember Ken Among, who's a producer yeah, there? Yeah, so Kenny. Kenny, I remember when we did it, he, <laughs> Kenny's the guy who's in charge of the budget each week. Yeah. And he goes like, Pally, this sketch better work because these chairs cost a fortune. <laughs> did he use the term Pally? He did use the term Pally. That is a uh, that is a catchphrase of Ken Among. So, uh, but you gave it your all. I take full responsibility. I thought it was a great bit. The audience, not so much. No, and it was. You... I think they were they were taking a dinner break at the time. Yeah. I don't know. And you've hosted enough to know. That wasn't like a maybe either or. Like it was a minute into that sketch. I yeah. think everybody involved knew, like, okay, this well, is it's not. One, it's one of those sketches. If, if you're doing it with Will Ferrell, he'd step on the gas and say, <laughs> yeah. "Not only are we going to crash, we're going to spread this thing over three acres." <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so that used to be fun, but yeah. like bombing in a sketch with him. Oh yeah. Yeah, because it was he just. <laughs> well, that back when you had, when I had a desk at SNL, like there was a, a you would go on the uh, server and watch old sketches, and we never watched things that went well. We were always like, <laughs> "Did you hear the one about where Will bombs so bad, <laughs> nobody in the audience made a sound, and he just like took the longest pauses? It was like, F you ass, <laughs> you're staying here all night." <laughs> uh, always so great to see it you. Thanks awesome. for everything.